All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly set up a call only ad in Microsoft Bing advertising. So technically, Microsoft doesn't have a call only ad like AdWords does, but you can configure your campaign in a way that it's going to serve up all of your traffic to people using mobile phones and you're going to be able to use call extensions. So they there's a higher probability when they click your ad, it's just going to call you instead of going to your website. But even though these are call only ads, most of the visitors are still going to end up on your website and that's really important to make sure it's mobile ready, mobile friendly, you have the call now button, I would have a form on it, maybe even live chat, just everything intended to capture that lead or get them to call. So real quickly, I've got this dentist one going. Um, HartfordDentist.info is the name of the campaign, but I'm using a different URL right now. I forget what it is. Uh, but you'll see I've spent $2.64 today. Um, you'll see that we this account here this is just like set as an affiliate account has had one call and has earned 10 bucks so pretty good uh, before i posted this i just posted in the facebook group my spend was like a dollar 50 so there's been a couple clicks since then no calls so still a really good return i'm hoping that a hundred percent return is what we can achieve so you can double your money it would be incredible you can't do that anywhere in the stock market um so if you can do anything even if you spend a hundred and bring back 150 with a 50 dollar profit that's a 50 percent roi that's fantastic especially on a really short term but the goal here is if you can double your money or better so let's look to see how do we set up an ad so how do we set up an ad let's let's start here so bing is a little convoluted like it's a tree so this is you know what you can be on all campaigns and then this will just like aggregate this all together or you can click on a campaign and now this section here is just for the dentist campaign but then it goes further off to the side and it's not real intuitive so ads and extensions these are where your extensions are to come out here so let's just set up a brand new one so you go to all campaigns you want to go to now oh, let's see overview or campaigns campaigns I'm not an expert at being, I'm just making profit on it. I'm going to show you, you guys and girls what I'm doing and hopefully you guys can take it another step and hopefully I'm going to figure it out as well. Um, so we're going to create a campaign. All right. So what is the goal of this calls to my business, right? And I've been clicking search ads. I don't even mess with anything else. All right. So we're going to name this campaign, um, seamless gutters. All right. Um, you can have a set your, you know, you can set a total campaign budget, um, like for your whole account and then share it amongst all your different campaigns. Like, but I just have an individual budget and your individual budget's up to you. I've been putting in them like a hundred bucks or 50 bucks. They, they don't spend it. They don't. It's not like Google where you put your budget in and they'll pretty much spend it. Bing is different, which is, which is fine. It's all about us figuring out where we can get these cheap clicks that we can turn into calls that we're going to make an ROI with. Um, so locations, this is where being, uh, Microsoft suffers. So with Google, which is really slick is you can download, let's say one of our zip lists for like plumbers or electricians, and then you can just paste it literally into Google a thousand zips at a time, um, and build out like a real specific location list with here, you're going to have to do it. So like I'm doing this nationwide, but it's not the best way to do it. You need to take time and uh, get your zip list and enter the locations. I would do it like by metros. And so there's no good way to do this other than metro by metro. So if I know like, let's say I'm doing gutters right now, I'm gonna do this nationwide, but I know it's not ideal because I'm gonna get calls from areas that I don't have gutters well monetized. Um, so if I was only to put in, let's say the um, probably 50 metros where I know gutters are well monetized, um, I'm going to have a much better experience. So I can just do like Chicago and it will give me, it will show you the DMA right here. And that's the one you want to do. Boom. You can do 25 miles around Chicago, but that's really not going to get you what the true Nielsen DMA. That's what they use for like the TV ratings. Uh, and that's going to be like the Chicagoland area, which includes more than a 25 mile radius around the center of Chicago. So uh, you're going to do that with every metro. But for right now, I'm going nationwide for for anything that you do, if you don't do this step, you're going to have a less ROI, 100%, because you want to exclude areas that don't pay out well. Or forget about excluding areas. You only want to target areas that are going to pay out better than others. So important step here. No easy way to do it other than entering each metro at a time. 
I'm skipping this. I'm going nationwide. Um, everything else, so um, people targeting your location. I mean, I just leave everything checked here. English, save, go to the next step. Self-explanatory at this point. Okay, so my website's URL is seamless.allguttersolutions.com. So let me get my website. My website is not ready. Okay, ad group name. It's called Seamless Gutters. All right, so it's giving me all of these additional suggestions. Now, key thing in terms of setting these up, if I, every time I pick one of these, if I tick the, those ad groups, I'm going to have to make a campaign specifically for them. Unlike Google, where you can add just thousands of keywords and then one ad is going to be suffice for all of them. This being requires you to make an ad for each individual one. So what I really want to do here is I want seamless gutters. I want, or, not, or maybe I want gutter repair. Let me see. Gutter cleaning. Let me see. See. So let's say with that first. So suggest you gutter cleaning, gutter accessories, seamless rain gutter, rain gutter seamless. <sighs> what 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 I can tell you is this. Well, and I've known this for you know since starting advertising um, a while ago, is that things that are essential like emergency services. Um, you know, plumbing, HVAC, any other time there's an emergency, people have to call. So someone needing new gutters is not really an emergency, but I, so I, I really want to prefer gutter repair. Almost like emergency gutter repair. I want people, and not like preying on people who are in problems, but that's what I want. I want someone who's in a, the gutters have, have ripped off their house or blown away, and they're like, I got to have this fixed right now. Um, so I guess we're going to do... Gutter protection, gutter cleaning, gutter tools, gutter parts, gutter repair. Let's see what we got. 230 keywords. You know, I'm just going to go for it and add them to the group. Okay. Add to a new group, add to all groups, add these to, I guess, add to a new group. That's the same. So they're all popped in there now. Okay. Awesome. Oh, and I guess if I wanted to, I can add them all just to this group. So if you just go ahead and plus away, it creates a groups for each one of them, but I could just add them all into there. So if I want, if I liked these five, I could, let's see, suggest and add to seamless gutters. Beautiful. All right, cool. Add to this group. And what I'm going to do is, did it not do it? Add. There we go. All right. So looks good. And, I, and I'm going to put in just a couple other ones here. I want emergency. All right. So add new group, save and go to the next step. All right. So call extensions. So this is important here. So this is since I selected to do a um, call ad in the beginning, it, it offers me up this call extensions. You could set up the ad a different way and then add the call extension in, but this will just force you to, to do this part. I've already added my, if you need you need to add your number in there, add it. I've already added my number in there previously, so I'm now going to associate this with this ad, that number. Uh, we need to create an ad. Okay, expand the text. So what I like to do is I like to just go on to... Um, Google and just do like the keyword I'm looking for. I see what these people are doing. Roof repair. Um, let me put um, a city with it. Uh, can't spell. There we go. Um, Oh, it didn't even kick up an ad. Let's just go. Gutter install repair, gutter insulation repair, seamless gutter Chicago. Uh, okay, so what? there's a couple things. When you set these ads up, I want to see if anything was inspiration there. One thing is you can do 
is keyword, which I believe has to be set up keyword insertion. So keyword insertion, you can play with this. This is where like whatever they search will show up in the ad. But I'm just going to go straight up emergency gutter repair title part two uh, three quotes title part three um, an emergency gutter repair free quotes uh, what do I want to say here um, call now. You can make a bunch of these and then add text one and two. This is where I'm not even want to think about where they were. Free inspection, inspection, all right, keep your card. Boom, boom, boom. Check a little of that. Where are we? And then add two. Um, You know, I don't put too much thought in this, and I probably should, but um, please do like put put thought into this, obviously, and, and just just for the sake of the video, I'm just going to try to blow, blow through it. Um, over URL, doesn't matter. All right, so this looks good. We can save and create another if we wanted. Just going to save and move on. Okay. Oh, did I miss something? Let's see. Oh, I need to put my URL in there. All right, save. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Everything looks good. Call out extensions, I don't do those. Um, you could do like something like call extension, like free estimate, free quote, uh, same day service, stuff like that. All right, save and go to the next step. All right, individual budget, $50. Okay, here's where we're getting. Start your bid at a buck. I think that's good. And I, I'm going lower on like the dentist one. I'm like 65 cents. Um, but some keywords, I'm 95 cents. And that's where really I think the optimization is going to come in is figuring out where the uh, clicks are going to come from, like the calls are coming from and where the best clicks are and where, you know, their negative keywords, clicks that you don't want to get. Um, so like DIY or how to, you especially don't want that, like how to DIY gutter installers and we don't want those clicks those are people not looking to hire somebody so it tells us here our monthly clicks is 37 estimated monthly impression I mean, it's really low um now here's kind of my thought is it's really low you know maybe it's showing it's really low but let me get it started and see what happens also i don't need to get more than a few calls i just need to make a profit on seamless gutters there's a hundred other services i can set this up for and that's kind of what my plan is going to be is to set up at least get to like 15 20 different campaigns going bidding very very low and even if i get a couple calls per day from each if i do 15 or 20 of them i've scaled that up um but like with the dentist i'm seeing below a dollar bid a lot of action so i'm going to leave it at a dollar for now i mean i can play with this let's see what it shows me when i do two bucks still below look at that i mean what do they want me 15 bucks get lost yeah, it's still showing me I'm going to be below first page. I don't believe it. All right. Campaign targets. This is where we're going to de decrease by 90% our t desktop and our, and our tablets. All right. Advanced campaign settings. Um, this is if you want to have start and end times, which you definitely should. Um, a lot of these things are 24 seven emergency, but even with like dentists, the, my conversions are going way down and I'm spending money. So I want to optimize how much money I'm like when I'm spending my money. And if I'm always spending it in the best times, my aggregate ROI on Bing is going to be much better. So, um, how do we do this? I haven't done this yet. So let's see. Targeted all days. Start time. I want to start at, um, Let's say 8 a.m. I don't know what time zone this is set to. We'll see. Uh, end time every day. I want to be done by, let's say, uh, with this for gutters, let's say 8 p.m. Um, start time, end time. Okay, so that's not doing anything. So what I'd want to do, let's do this backwards then. 
So at 8 p.m. till 7 a.m. 45, we want to decrease our bids by 90%. And I guess you can mess around with that. So that's pretty good. So start time 8 p.m. End time must be later than start time. So I guess I gotta have to do two of them. So okay, so um, so let's do that again. So starting time at 8 p.m. Ending time at 12. Oh, it's gotta be 11:45. Decrease by so from that time to that time. That's weird. Will it let me choose 12 a.m. or is it going to think that it's backwards? Yeah, that's silly. So, okay. So all day, so starting at 8, ending at 11.45, I'm going to decrease, decrease my bids by 90%. And then starting all days uh, at 12 a.m. until 7 a.m. or 7.45. I'm going to also decrease by 90%. So let me just review that again. So starting at 8 to 11.45, it'll be decreased. It'll be that 15 minutes where I'm not too worried about uh, where I'll have normal bidding. And then um, from 12 a.m. until 7.45 a.m., it'll be decreased. So basically, I'll start at 7.46 is when my thing will start. Okay, there's my time zones using Central America, which is fine. I'm, I'm U.S. Uh, Central, so whatever, same one. Okay, here we go. Save. And that's it. So that's it. That's how you set it up. We got the call extensions. And then one thing is this here, this like mobile ready. Make sure your site, I mean, this is how people are going to see, see it on, on the mobile. So just make sure it looks good. I mean, the call now button's there. We got another call there. Um, you know, everything loads up fine because this is really what's going to hit. Make sure you have analytics or stat counter on your website so you can, you know, see the traffic that's coming in. Um, and then just, you got to just check to see what's going on with um, the how, the spend versus what you're bringing back in. So let's see if anything's happened since I've started this. So, oh, so there's, yeah, the, look at that. Clicks up with 784. So let's go back to here. Let's refresh my page. And boom, here we go. So we had... A couple calls come in. Let's see what happened here. So this was a call that had already paid out, the 10 bucks. Um, we had another call now that it must have not connected. This Saturday morning, the day after Christmas, probably is not the ideal time to be running these. I should be really running these probably Monday through Friday through business hours. But, um, you know, I, if I can get a profit, I'm going to do it. Uh, and then it looks like, yeah, two other calls come in and they look like they couldn't connect. Hopefully they'll call back. But that's awesome. So, I mean, I've spent, um, what have I spent? So, I've spent $7.84. We've had four calls come back. Yep, I'm up a couple bucks. Um, easily one of those things could have converted. And, uh, you know, exciting. Exciting. It's a lot like gambling, but um, I think a little bit more stable. I think you come up with a strategy and uh, get wins every time. So, I haven't lost any money yet. And, I'm, again, I'm using affiliate payouts, the same payouts that you're going to see. Um, so... Get started. Uh, if you have any questions, like in terms of what to try, there's so many different, um, I mean, there's just so many things you can try. I'd really look to see within the niches of the popular services. So like within the highest paying, best converting are like plumbing, heating, cooling, electric, um, and see within those, those potential niches. So like water heaters, um, electrical panels, uh, like I need to get a 220 volt outlet installed. I mean, that's, that can be up to like a couple grand depending on how, you know, what my panel looks like now and all that. So there's, there's really good niches within each one of these services that you can get in on. Um, like right now we're going to try gutters. Uh, there's concrete, there's driveway ceiling, there's landscaping, there's tree service. There's just so much. So I'm getting, I have Vision Row right now just cranking out these landing sites for me. Uh, these simple uh, one page, not one page, but, you know, like I showed you earlier. So here's the, um, so just a nice, you know, 
text, since it's not SEO, we're jacking the text straight up from other websites and just obviously changing them, make sure their business name or city names are in there. But this is an SEO, so we're going to get the text from wherever we get it the quickest. Um, he's going to add a few more things because there should be a form on here. Again, you wouldn't see the site like this. Everyone's going to see it under the mobile version, but uh, nice little landing page. Start with whatever offer you can get with me. I, I can give you the one I would think I would start with. You can even try dentist if you like. Um, and then get yourself a Bing account. And when you sign up with Bing, again, you get a $25. If you spend $25, you get a $100 credit. And I've seen floating around, you can look, search for like Bing credits for Bing advertisement, like gift cards and stuff. They're, they're out there. I've seen ones for like $250 that you can get. So, um, all right. Anyone have any questions? Let me know. And, um, I'll probably make another video a little shorter and to the point. Um, now that I have a better handle of what I got to show everybody, but I figured enough people are asking, I'll make a quick video right now. And if anyone wants to start, uh, just let me know. I'll help you pick out the first, uh, category. Make sure you have your offer set up in Ringba or the Leadsmart dashboard, whatever, and you have your tracking number and you're ready to go. All right. Thanks so much, everybody.